They're not better than Jordans. Don't get me wrong. I didn't say that. Don't, either. don't you dare. <laughs> I'm looking at you. Don't comment. I know. Don't press enter. Don't I send that. I know you want to comment. <laughs> don't you dare. What's good, people? Welcome back to your favorite UK sneaker review channel program episode. I'm here with Dapper Dan himself. Oh, Dapper Dan. Had to do it. Do I had to what? do it. Flamboyant Dan. Flamboyant. Flare level 20. And I'm here with, what's a J, Josh? Wow. Josh, Josh. Man to, man wow. I'm trying, I, to, I'm I give trying man, to think of a... I give man nothing but love. You I'm see the love intro? The love to... intro. It's all right. Just Josh. Just Josh. Josh, Josh would do. It's all right. Let's move on. Yeah. So, yeah, I'll, before I'll we there. start, just want to apologize to all of the team members of Brentford. Brentwood. Hey, don't, because the two is mad. Brentford FC, who fought hard to get their promotion. I mistakenly, mistakenly mistook your name for Brentwood. Yep, it's, it's an easy mistake. Sort of. Ivan, I saw your goal for Peterborough, FA Cup. I was, I was there doing the highlights on YouTube. I see it, the half waiting. Oh yeah, it's and then a celebration. I rate you. I rate your people. Them. It's, it's nice that he went to Peterborough and then obviously he got a move to Brentwood. Some so like Brentwood it's, this, it's down. some yeah. alliance thing. But we we move. We, we, we do move. We anyway, move. Anyway, like I said, I'm a man of integrity, so I own up to my mistakes. Aye. And I and I out them. That's all we can ask, Josh. That is all we can ask. But today we're gonna have another smiling Josh. It's another good episode. Last episode, Josh was smiling. Never seen myself smile so much. I got I, I got smile lines. Is that bad? Do you know how so nice that was? how beautiful it was and you guys really reacted to it in the comments. No, they got to me about the MNST. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> he was smiling, he was happy all episode and then he went and said the wildest statement ever. Listen, but the people getting on to me in the comments, bruv, your parents more than likely shop at Lidl. I don't want to eat your grapes are not from MNST. Oh, do you remember when we were younger, yeah? And if you shopped at Netto mm. or if your parents shopped at Netto, mm. you're a waste man. Yeah. However, now, if Neto was, is Neto still open? No, I don't think no, it is. It's closed. If Neto was still open, I'd see a couple of you man in there. It was pretty Not me, because I'd be at Aldi. But, or Lidl. Lidl bakeries. Bro, the croissants. And the cinnamon. Listen, let's not get into this let's again. Do, let's, <laughs> let's do this again. Into this All right, so. But we've got a good episode. I've got yep. four on my side. You've I'm got four, four on your yep. side. And we've got some bangers here. So, because yep. I started last time, you're making me start this time. JJ, uh, just Josh. I said JJ, just You kill me with Dapper Dan, bro. I can't even follow that up, man. You put me up here. I put you up here. That's, that's, yeah. what, that's what I do for my fellow black man. Let's get on with the shoes, please. Yeah, Thank right. you. Cool. All right, so it's a tough one. You know what? Whew. It's hard. It's hard. You don't know what to go with first. I don't know what to go with first. I'm going to go with the Yeezy. The Yeezy 500 Taupe Light. The reason I'm going with this yeah. is simply because, do you remember a few weeks ago we had yeah. the Inflame? I knew you were going to say that. And I was like, what you need to do is do one colour. Kanye listened, fine. <laughs> Shout out you. Do you know what? It's your birthday today. Happy birthday, happy Kanye. Birthday. It's not you going out on your birthday, but happy birthday to this week. For this you. week, yeah. yeah. My, my favourite artist. Yeah? One of the smartest people in the world. You know what? I, saying that, it's like, it's funny because he's, you perceive him as a bit wild, wild. But when you listen to what he's saying, this guy talks so much sense. Yes. He speaks so much sense. You're just not on his wavelength. Facts. Same with these. Same with the inflames, actually. No one was on his. No one, no, one was on, no, no one was on that. No, no one was really Nobody on was on that. But these, yeah. I don't hate them. I, I quite like this colorway. I'm just fighting against my hatred for 500s. Oh, I see. But I, I don't know. Right. But, but as far as 500s go, mm. Yeah, this is up there. I think some colorways really do it justice. Yeah. I feel like some of the colorways have ruined it a little bit, but just that iteration of it. But, but that's Yeezy in general, because mm. they've been releasing 10 million colorways mm. on one shoe. <laughs> yeah, genuinely, people lose focus on what the good ones are. They're yeah. like, oh, okay, it's another Yeezy colorway. It's another Yeezy colorway. Yeah. As far as these go, yeah, it's a really good colorway. Do I like 500s? No, I yeah. don't. I'm not going to change my mind. Yeah. You lot can comment all you want. Yeah. I'm, I'm not going to change my mind on 500s. You, like, they look good on people. Mm. I think someone said we should introduce a point system. Oh, that's a great idea. I like that. Whoever commented that, I shout think I liked your comment. Shout yourself out. But yeah, shout yourself out. We yeah. should do a point system. So out of 10, should, what are you giving should, should we do it now or should we set? Out of 10? I think let's do this, let's, let's do it out of 10. Colorway. Mm -hmm. uh, Cause it's a 500, to me, I'd go midi, it's five. I'd, five. I'd, I'd go uh, like five, six. Okay. To get a 10. Yeah, okay. It's got that, a that's a, that's a Air Yeezy one. That's it, we're in October. 
No, 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 that's a two. I know it's a two, but I just mean yeah. to talk. Yeah, that's, that's an that that easy level. one. Like, yeah. Level, 10. Okay. Yeah? Five. 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 What, what about you? I'd give it a... Ooh. Yeah, I'd give it a six, seven. 6.5. Just because of the colour, I like this kind of colour. I, I like my like my earthy tones. Yeah, and so you I, don't mind the five hundred silhouette. And I don't mind the five hundred silhouette. So, okay. Yeah, I'd give it. A I respect it. Yeah. I'm going with a similar tone. Okay. Night Dunk Low, mm. Giraffe. Your face has already told me all no, I need to know about it. No, you know what? A couple of places are calling it different things because I heard it was called the Giraffe as well. But yeah. I think someone called it the Cheetah. The so, cheetah? I don't know what it is. I just know it's an the animal cheetah. print. Yeah, bro, I've seen it somewhere as a cheetah. I'm just like, am I bugging out? The cheetah? The che this isn't even a cheetah colour. Let's call it the giraffe. We're calling it giraffe. I I'm back in giraffe. I think they look nice. Again? Yeah, again, I think with the lemon drop one, I'm still thinking of that. That's like my pinnacle now yeah. of dunk. So everything the else The lemon drop like, one was up there. That's what I'm saying. The quality of materials, yeah. the way it's put together. Yes. I thought it was going to be a novelty shoe. Yeah. It's not a novelty shoe. This one, is it a novelty shoe? Is it a bit leave it for you? I like, I said this before as well. I, I think I said this last week when they yeah. released. I said, if they did not call it the giraffe mm. and they just released it as a colorway, mm. I would like it a lot more. But now they've associated it to, to an animal. Yeah. I've, it kind of feels a bit childish to me. I hear that, I hear that. I think if they did it all, as we said before with the inflame, if they didn't do too much with the color blocking, if they maybe came, kept it this darker shade, yeah. they would be crazy. Yep, I mean, but then it's the same as what released as well, uh, Dunk Low. The Dunk Curries. The Curries. Mm. It's a very similar kind of colorway. The materials aren't bad though. The material's good. The material on this is good. The, the leather here the is, le the, it's, the level's awful. But the suede overlays, that's nice. But the suede, to be honest, you can't really skimp on, on suede. I yeah. never really see a shoe with poor suede. Yeah. Poor, poor suede. You can't really, can you, I suppose? Uh, is it a high quality dunk? No. No. It's, it's like you not. put nice suede on a, you put premium suede on... On a factory dunk. That's exactly, that's exactly what they've done. Yeah. However, do I like the colorway? Yes, I do. Take off the giraffe and take off the patches. Yes, I think it's a crazy colorway. Yeah. Dunk curry, I'd rather have the dunk curries. Facts. Yes. Yeah. I wouldn't have it if it's called giraffe. They're releasing another one, a black, a black. There's a zebra one. Zebra. Mm, or zebra, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, to me, novelty dunk. Rate yeah. out of 10, six, because I think it's better than the 500. Wow, you give this a six. Okay, no, I don't give it a six. <laughs> <laughs> you know what you can say to him, I'm like, really? Oh. <laughs> you know when you assess it, and I think six. That's high. It's very high. If a easy one is 10 for you, this is, this is a six. You say, no, 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 we'll you put it off the chart. That's, you, you, know, you know what the, high, you know, know, you know what the easy is? Hmm. Yeezy is Messi and Ronaldo. We'll go five. I'll go equal playing field. I'm okay. not going to drop it to a four because it's yeah. a dunk yeah. and you can't go wrong with a dunk. Would I wear this? I, I might do. One I'm or not two times. Lie. Yeah, one or two times, but I yeah. wouldn't buy it because it's called a giraffe. Yeah. That's where we're going to end it. <laughs> That's where we're going to end it. I think for me, it gets a five. Yeah. Even lower than this, because I think, again, you've got the premium overlays, but then you've got the standard factory leather dunk, leathers, and yeah. That's yeah. It. Yeah. Welcome so, to the five, five gang. Five, five yeah. Gang. Oh, it's yours. Sorry, That's my man. size. I know it's your size. Yeah, but I still wouldn't wear it, man. You would. Probably. Like, it's, 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 the thing is, when I say when I wear something, it's like when I wear it for a prolonged period of time. And yeah. And like, would I value it? Would that, I treasure? That's it? what I'm saying. Where I would I'd treasure. Probably, I'd probably wear every shoe here, like once or twice. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? If, Why not? If I had the op. Why not? If I had the opportunity. Even those easy bright blues. They're dope. I'd, but the thing is, I said, mm, I'm not feeding them. So yeah. me, I'd wear them like once or twice and then they'd get put in the box and, and that's it. You know? Yeah. Fairway culture. Anyway. Wow. We live in a fairway culture. Wasteful. Anyway, next up, the ready-made blazer mid black camo. I love this shoe. It's, it's an interesting shoe. I love it. I'm going to bring the white ones as well so we can analyze them together. You see what I did there? Analyze. Analyze. I, I love this shoe. Yeah. Obviously, it's the Japanese brand Ready Made. Yep. Dope brand. They make a lot of their materials from upcycled or recycled military materials. Sustainable thing. So it's a sustainable thing. Yeah. Very, These very went clean. off yep. just before they released. Yep. Do you want to know why? Go on. For this life, I cannot change. Of course. Of it course. is. So Travis wore a pair. And everyone, now everyone, then everybody wanted them. Then everybody wanted them, and then they sold, and then nobody really wanted them. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair though, Travis aside, again, like I said last week with collabs, yeah, 
it's an amazing piece of artwork, bro. Look at look at this. You know we love details. Look look at the undersole. Just check that. And I know what it's like. This is obviously recycled and upcycled. I can tell 100 percent by yep. the kind of the, the textures and detailing within it. I like the midsole. It kind of looks like a cloud. Yeah, unbelievable, bro. I just bro, I, I don't know what it is. I like the shoe. I I wanted. I tried to get both these pairs on release. I still I'm still due to get this pair. Yeah. Um, you can tell from when someone's putting this much detail into a sole, mm. you know the shoe means something because essentially you're not really going to see the sole. Yeah. It's not like everyone doing up the lube. You know when people are doing the lube, they're going to Oh, the red sole thing, just the... Doing, going, doing, 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 red bottom. Doing it. So, <laughs> that one. <laughs> like, who sits like that? Yeah, for real. But, sit in a restaurant just like yeah. this. Wait up. Can I, can I? I've got lubes on. Yep. <laughs> if you did that, shoe. I don't even like red bottoms like that. Shame. Like, yeah, like, and you're not wearing them no more, so joke's on you, my friend. For real. That's, that's an expensive You're mistake. looking for some likes. So. <laughs> 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 but uh, I like it. Every yeah. piece of the shoe looks like it's been thought about, the yeah. materials used. Yeah. Even this, like the side, pa these panels, bro. The reinforce extra reinforcement and it's kind of been fingered oh, in. And it's been tied together. So, you know, like on your military garments, like such like your rain jackets, your your high tech yeah. jackets, bro. They've got all these kind of features on it. Yeah. So it, it's a beautiful shoe. I like what they did with the swoosh as well. Yeah. No, I do like that. And now I'm gonna get hit, but I would much sooner wear these than Jordans any day of the week. You know why? You know why? I've always been someone until like recently. Um, I like the more obscure shoes, bro. I don't mm -hmm. like to be out here in bait things. I like the obscure things. So yeah. you see me in like before it, before it kind of dropped like more commercially like. Filling pieces, I was feeding those, Axel Arigato. Yeah. yeah. And if you do like alternative trainers, it's not necessarily that Jordans are bad. Mm. Jordans are probably one of the best shoes ever created next mm. to Air Force Ones. Yeah. Like, don't be mad at people for wearing different colored Jordans. I love Jordans. However, these are better than the majority of new releases yeah. that I've seen from Jordan. Yeah. They're not better than Jordans. Don't get me wrong. I didn't say that don't, either. Don't you dare. <laughs> I'm looking at you. Don't comment. I know. Don't press enter. Don't I send that. I know you want to comment. <laughs> don't you dare. Don't you dare. Someone's there with a the key. I'm so, looking at so, dead in the eyes. Someone's well. there like this. <laughs> <laughs> I want to cover myself. As yeah, bro. Before press you the button. that finger. Yeah. Allow it. Them keyboard warriors. But beautiful shoe. Yep. I rate this. Oh, come on. You're rating. Do you want to know why I rate this this gun? Because one, it's quite an obscure shoe. Mm. So if you do know, you know. Mm. Two, the materials, the detailing, everything that goes into it is top tier. Mm -hmm. Three, it's a blazer. And they've made me like blazers. That's what you, that's. Again, I'm rating shoe. this an eight, solid. Bro, I was gonna say the same a thing. A solid eight. Okay. This is a, gr this yeah, is a great shoe. Both colorways as well. Yeah, I, prefer, I would probably sooner wear this one than yeah. that one. But oh, hundred. Both colorways are hard. Hundred, but if you're giving me both Nike, or Nike, sorry. Yeah, shoot us both, yeah. Trust me. But I'm gonna get them anyway. Yeah. Might end up getting these as well. Wait, you know what, I'm, I'm considering that as well. All right, beautiful <laughs> shoe. All right, so. Was it me? Well, you came with your one, and I came with my. I came out when you came with your one, so it's things me again. It's you again. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you do you. I will do me. So, next up, woman's Air Jordan One release. This is big because they don't really release highs for women. So, yep. Woman out there. Woman out there. Shout out you. This one's for you. So these Jordan One highs. Yeah. There was a few metallic, like in the metallic pack. Yeah. That released. Yeah. I believe it was. There's a blue pair. Yeah. There's a green pair. Yeah. Um, there's obviously OG ones, which is very similar to this with the Nike Air. Yeah. Um, obviously, no, the material is really good on this. I was going to yeah. say better material, but it's not. It's really good material. Yeah. Then there was another release, which had the Jumpman on the back, which obviously is a big faux pas for some Jordan lovers. Yeah. Again, make your own deductions from that. If you like the Jumpman on the back, you hit the Jumpman on the back. Bro, for the OG it? sneakerheads, they have a problem with it. They're not having it. Don't ask me why. Go on, comment below. They're I don't know why. It. I wouldn't. I think it's because the original ones didn't, didn't I believe? Yeah. yeah. I I wouldn't wear one with a jump man on the back. It's a bit. Yeah, nah. It would be a bit loud. It's a bit loud. Can, imagine it? having that and then that just just <laughs> and just just <laughs> all over the back of the shoe and that. Nah, I'm um, good, good. So obviously this is the kind of remake of the 1986 version. I think that was that was the version initially. Yep. Women's only, all white soft leather, which it's great leather. It's, it's, it's it, amazing leather. 
This has been getting, <laughs> let me be real, this has been getting a lot of hate. This, this colorway in particular? Yeah, by the sneaker community. Everyone's like, oh, nah, this is a trash colorway. I don't really like this. Yeah. It's, it's kind of garbage. I think this is, I think, I think it's great. I've seen worse. I've seen much worse. This is, this is the thing, this is pretty You're plain. You lot have been buying worse. This is, this is plain. Like, yeah. That's as, that's as clean as you're probably gonna get. Literally, if I had, if this was green and I said this is trash, you'd be like, be onto me. This yeah. is plain. It's plain. It's clean. I know a lot of people might be put off by the purples. Don't buy court purples then. You can start purple well. You can start purple Purple's very well. And what I would do personally, if I had a pair, you mm. know what I'd do. I like my aged kicks. Yeah. I would age the midsole. I'd yellow it a bit. I think it looked mm. crazy. However. I don't understand why it's been getting hate. Like, why don't you guys like this trainer? Comment below, let us know. Because it's been getting a lot of hate from the sneaky community. Yeah. Don't know why. I, th I think it's dope. And I think the materials used on this, great. Yeah. I don't think it's a bad shoe. I don't think it's a bad colorway. I think it's, I think it's decent. Six and a half? No. No? No. What's not, it? not for me. Five it's not half. five. It's not them 500s. Yeah, but you get the 500s or five. I get them a 6.5, remember that? Yeah, exactly. So I would give this like a 5.56. But just because, again, I said 5.56. Oh, or, oh, 5.5 slash six. six. Yeah, oh, yeah. I thought you meant 5.56. You thought I was getting into decimals. I thought you were going into recurring <laughs> thing. I thought you were doing the recurring. <laughs> I was thinking, this guy. Yeah, so I, I think it's in between a 5.5 and a six. It's definitely not a five, because I don't think it's just basic shoe. I like the shoe. A Jordan 1, I, I, and again, we talked about this. I know a lot of people like Jordan 1s. I really like Jordan 1s. Mm. You can't go wrong with a pair of Jordan 1s. The silhouette, Beautiful. Fire. Some of the colorways that they're putting on it, that's where you lose me. Questionable. However, you can't put a Jordan 1 under a 5. You can't put a Jordan 1 under a 5 because yeah. the silhouette alone beats the majority of trainers. This one, especially this colorway, mm. I think it can be styled well. Yeah. 6.5, I'm sticking to it. Cool. That's my story. That is my ghetto story. Yeah, like I said, it's strong. I haven't got anything bad to say about it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I used to wear purple trainers back in, not purple trainers, but I used to have purple trainers back in the day. Yeah. So, you know, it's Yeah, it's a what win. do you guys think? What would you rate this out of 10? Uh, yeah. Obviously, they're Jordans. <laughs> they're purple. They're white. They're white. And before anyone says anything about why they're not laced, because they're dead stock. So if we lace them, they're no longer dead stock and people will return them. Yeah, exactly. It's not that we couldn't be bothered to do it. Yeah. 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 It's not that we, sure. No, it's dead stock, man. <laughs> Let me bring another dead stock out. Oh, oh. These are the Jordan 1 GS origin story. Yes, they See, are. See, another collab. This is another Jordan silhouette, which yeah. you can't go wrong with. I think this is a beautiful shoe. I think this is a beautiful collab. Well done, Jordan. Why are you smiling like that? This would not be Justin if I didn't say something wild and outlandish. Say something wild and outlandish then. Go on, mate. The outsole. Yeah. Trying to do some icy outsole. Reminds me of the trophy rooms. <laughs> Go. You can't say anything bad. That's not that's not a bad comment. I didn't say it's a bad comment. I'm just no. To I'm be honest, saying. that is one of the best takes that you've compared them to because you've compared some awful, awful trainers. You have. Don't remember. Own it. A man of integrity. Don't recall. Stop no, saying. No comment. <laughs> right. Yeah. But I plead the fifth. <laughs> no comment. He pleads the fifth. But that's a good take, mm. obviously, because it's the same colorway. I had to, I had to be very careful you about how I worded like, that. You saw me in it like, I was like, how do I? I no, to... but if he worded it, no, but this is a good comparison. You could have said that with chess. So when this released, people were climbing the walls, literally yeah. climbing the walls. I, I like that, that was good. There was one video I see, it was in um, Paris. <laughs> what, that was climbing walls? Oh, but people like trying, there was like mad queue, people were trying to climb on the walls to get to the front of the queue. It was mad. Shout out you, man, very in theme. Uh, this is a great shoe, great quality shoe. Yeah. As collabs are, I don't think we've ever seen a collab really yeah. with bad quality. Um, we obviously had men's size and now we have a GS size. So hit us up if you really want this. I like this little accent. Like, you see that? Yeah, the, the blue Nike. It, it, it's dope, man. It fits in with the Spider-Man costume. Obviously yeah. it's got the... the um... What's that web? No, 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 it's the dots. You know, like the, the style on the side. What on the... Miles Morales. Yeah, bro. Like, do you not watch the film? I watched the film like three times. It's wavy as well. Into the Spider-Verse. I still don't get the dots though. Go watch that. Go watch it. Even I though you're late. And it's not in cinemas no more. It's on Netflix. Shout out Netflix. If you want to give me a free subscription for shouting you out. We're just out here looking for all these brand deals, yeah? Listen. Aldi. 
if I don't receive Free an shopping email for a year, listen. If I don't receive, nah, don't worry. Now nah, you're doing MNS up. If I want, nah, actually, no, I'd, I'd love you MNS. You want MNS? Oh, I want MNS as well. I don't yeah. want their shopping, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want. I, I don't want full MNS groceries. I like you need to know how to shop around, innit? We need to drop this, don't we? We do need to we drop do. this. We're gonna. Drop Should we go to the next shoe? Yeah, we'll go right, to the next shoe. shoe. What have you got? Last one for me. Okay, no, let me go then. Alright, you got, you got, you let got. Let me go, go then, because yeah, yeah, yeah. He's yeah, 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 got yeah. a bit of a banger. It's a banger. It's Sabanga. Night Dunk Low UNC Uni Blue people yeah. are saying it's a UNC colorway. Yeah. Obviously, Jordan went to University of North Carolina. He did. This is the colorway. This is very similar to the coasts. A little the bit lighter, coast, it? Yes, a little bit lighter. Yeah. It doesn't have the yellow accent. So yeah. obviously it had a yellow accent on the Nike um, tongue lapel. Yeah. It had the back panel Nike, which was yellow. Yeah. And then on the aglets as well. Do I like this better than the coast? Yes, minor differences, just because it's more original, yeah. more OG. Yeah, yeah. That is the only reason. If not, it's the same shoe. damn shoe. It's the same shoe. This. It's the same. It's the same. Yeah. Same, same, but different. So yeah, I think summer shoe is all right. Yeah. It's no, just... no, no. It's a very good shoe. It will sell out. I like it. Oh, yeah, I think this is out. a solid seven out of ten. It's saying seven. It's yeah. It's solid. It's okay. solid. Where can you go wrong? What's wrong with this? That's shoe? what I'm saying. I can't have nothing bad to say about this exactly. shoe. Exactly. I think so... for me, it's just knowing dunks as well and how I. I'm more high than low, but I like the colorway. I love lows. I think it's a beautiful yeah. shoe. I think everyone's gonna buy it yeah. as per usual. Yeah. It's a great colorway, UNC colorway. And especially this summer, it's hot as hell outside, man. And it's gonna get hotter. We're gonna get harder. It's getting... no, so no, when lockdown's it. over, 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 and you lot are doing up dubs and, you know, Portugal when it's back on green and Spain and them. Don't worry about this awesome. amber list, man. Amber don't exist. But right. yeah, let's go on to the last one. So that's a seven for me. What's that for you? Six. Six? Six. This guy's being tight today, but it's fine. So what did this get? What did the, the cheetah drafting get? What did, what did I give that? Five and a half, six. This. What did I give that? I don't even remember. It's better than that either way. Okay, so let's. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, so I have to bring up both shoes for the next one. Yep. Because it's special. Should I hold one? You hold one. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, what? Yeah. You, what the pool? What the pool? I don't know if he, he meant to do that or not, but. What the pool? <laughs> pool. So, <laughs> this is obviously the Nike Dunk Low What the Pool. This released a couple of weeks back, and it's obviously references the skateboarder, Paul Rodriguez. Shout out you. The first skateboarder to get his signature Nike collab. Signature Nike shoe, should I say? Yeah, the Nike SB, isn't it? Yeah, uh, that was in 2005 as well. Yeah, so, I know he's a cult hero over in America. Yeah, obviously, massive following. Every skater loves him. So obviously, as we can see on this one, we've got the kind of toe box from I think it's the Stash edition. Yeah, um, and there's kind of like the elephant print from some of his other editions as well. Yeah, I think that's the J. It's J. Rod. The J. Rod he takes a lot of inspiration from yeah. Jordan. And then we've got the kind of the outsole, which takes inspiration from the 2020 Mexican Dunk High. Um, and then obviously you got quilted in a lining as well. That's quite nice to be fair. Do you know quilted what? The whole nice. shoe it's made well. It's crazy. It's made very well. Yeah. Great materials. I think this is one of the best dunks released or the best collab dunks mm -hmm. as an art piece mm -hmm. this year or next to the Chunky Dunky, bro. I would put this in the same bracket as the Chunky Dunky okay. for what it is. Yep. For what it is as a shoe, yeah. I think people see the Chunky Dunky as a novelty dunk, and obviously it's gone off because all the influences everyone was wearing. Everyone's, them, got, them, Everyone's, right? got, Everyone's them. got them. Everyone's got them. I think I've, I've watched a documentary on um, on Paul Rodriguez, yeah. and he was talking about how this signifies every moment of his career. He's had some great moments as looking from the shoe. Do you know what I mean? I really like the right shoe better. I think this quilted Mexican blanket. Yeah, that's from the Mexican blanket. Unbelievable. Yeah. yeah. I think the just the materials used. I think it's this is an underrated shoe, maybe in our British culture, because a lot yeah. of people aren't really as familiar with him as they are in America. Yeah, yeah, I hear that. Someone even said, to be honest, um, I'd like to get your opinion on it. This, the what the pool is the shoe of the year. It's not an outrageous statement to me. No. It's actually not that outrageous. I see, like, as I said, I put that in the caliber of the Chunky Dunky. Yeah. I think in 10 years time, people will be bending over backwards to try and get a pair of these because Facts. it was a moment. Facts. But everything about it, look at the, the, look at the accents. Shoes, yeah, the way cool. this shoe is put together, brilliant. They yeah. put however many shoes together and made it still look good. And there's two stories on each shoe. For me, nine. 
Nine. Nine. Strong. Nine. Strong. And if you say it's shoe of the year, I, you probably have a fair argument. If you come with the right points. I'm just trying to think of what else was released this year, collab-wise, that's been big. Collab-wise? I know the, the Supreme Dunks released, but, I but I, again, I wasn't really you feeling You weren't really them. feeling them. I, I like the Supreme Dunks, however, yeah. I don't think that's this caliber. Yeah. I think no, Supreme is... Dunks, in terms of nostalgia, for yeah. the highs, for the, 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 the previous release, yeah. yes, I like it. D do I think they're release of the year? No. Yeah. Yeah. I'd even much prefer the Amy Leon Dore New Balance. Yeah, I said that yeah. that's, that is one of the most slept on, and yeah, now yeah, they've yeah. discontinued them. You'll see. They're discontinued now. Again, Discon the, F the, the 550 or. The f no, the Amy Leon Dore 550 New Balance. Bruh, that's discontinued. It, that's it. You'll listen when you are dead. I that's told it, you. That's it. It's I game told over. You, it's I game over. It's game over then. Good it's luck. It's game get over. Now. Try, get <laughs> them, try get them in a year's time. You're looking at a grand. You're looking at grands. Bro, respect to you, P Rod. Shout out you. Shout out you and your shoe. That'll be a great way to end the episode because this is probably one of the shoes of the year for me. Yeah. If you want to argue that it is shoe of the year, get in the comments. Yeah. Let us know. Also, subscribe, like, turn on post notifications so you know when we've got our next video out. But trust, that's been another episode, that's my another episode. Stay tuned for Steve-O sneaker shopping and ZZ Mill sneaker oh, shopping wow, as yeah. well. They'll I'd, be coming next couple of weeks. I that it's crazy. You, you heard it here first. They're, they're, they're dope. They're sick people. Funny episodes. You heard it here first. Funny episodes. Make sure you man. tune in. But yeah, catch you next time. Dapper Dan and Josh Josh. Josh. And, and <laughs> Josh and Josh. Josh, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. <laughs> 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 <laughs>